how did we get here? The trash problem has been growing since the beginning of the pandemic. Over the past year, the regional government metro has received more than 7,000 complaints about illegal dump sites in the Tri-County area. The vast majority of the complaints are in Portland. Before the pandemic started, Metro's RID program would respond to an illegal dumping site in about a few days. Right now, if you report trash, it takes an average of 46 days, about a month and a half, for a crew to come out and clean it up. Data shows that since October, the number of sites cleaned has dropped significantly. Part of the problem, Metro says, is that as soon as they clean up some sites, they get trashed again. And we have a lot of reoccurring sites, so we will get them cleaned up and then they become a problem again. When COVID hit, Portland suspended clearing homeless camps for months. Trash that would have normally been cleaned up instead piled up. But Metro's data shows that 60% of the trash they clean up comes from residential sources and 37% of it is from homeless people. They say the evidence comes from photos and videos, but also from mail and documents in the trash. Metro cut its workforce in half when it stopped using inmates to clean up dump sites last year. Without that labor, only a pair of two-person crews has been cleaning up all of the sites. Many areas of the city, especially along Interstate 84, haven't been touched since 2019. And that's how we got here.